Hello, welcome to Christ the King's Compline service. This is Friday, September 10th. The opening sentence on page 57. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord. The maker of heaven and earth. Let us humbly confess our sins to Almighty God. Almighty God and Father, we confess to you, to one another, and to the whole company of heaven that we have sinned through our own fault in thought and word and deed and what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, have mercy upon us, forgive us our sins, and by the power of your Holy Spirit, raise us up to serve you in newness of life, to the glory of your name. Amen. Almighty God, grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. We'll now have the psalm reading and the scripture reading. The psalm reading is Psalm 134, verses 1 through 4. Behold now, praise the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, you that stand by night in the house of the Lord, even in the courts of the house of our God. Lift up your hands in the sanctuary and sing praises unto the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth give you blessing out of Zion. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The scripture tonight is uh, from Isaiah chapter 30, verse 15. For thus said the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, in returning and rest you shall be saved. In quietness and in trust shall be your strength. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep me, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. O Lord, hear our prayer. And let our cry come to you. Let us pray. O oh God, your unfailing providence sustains the world we live in and the life we live. Watch over those both night and day who work while others sleep. And grant that we may never forget that our common life depends upon each other's toil. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. We now have the nunc dimittis. Guide us waking, O oh God, and guard us sleeping that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, now let your servant depart in peace according to your word, for my eyes have seen your salvation, which you have prepared before the face of all people, to be a light to lighten the Gentiles, and to be the glory of your people Israel. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us this night and evermore. Amen.